みなさんこんにちは。Welcome. Hi everyone. My name is Kai. I'm Vietnamese and I have been living in Tokyo for e years. So today we are at the Kiyosu Mishirakawa area for some walking tour. And there's gonna be one more member who's gonna join me today. So, ちょっと待ってね。Hello, welcome. My name is Minami, and I am Japanese. I grew up in Tokyo, but I lived in Australia for six years when I was 18 to 25 years old. And I am very looking forward to exploring Kiyosu Mishirakawa area today. おみなみちゃん。やっほー,ー,ー,ー,ー,ー,ー,ー,ー,ー。おはよう。はい。来ましたね。来ましたね。そっちそっち。<笑><笑>私と私は。Okay, our member have already prepared introduction about this area for us. So let's just read it for our viewer. Okay. You ready? Okay. So Kiyosumi Shi, ah, I can get this name right. Kiyosumi Shirakawa. Okay. Kiyosumi Shirakawa is a neighborhood in the eastern part of Tokyo called Kotoku. Kotoku, ne? Hmm. Often comes out where the old Tokyo meets the new Tokyo. Kiyosumi offers a glimpse from the past through its traditional Fukagawa district, where hip coffee shops and roastery are also be found here and there. No wonder why it is now one of the trending areas in Tokyo when it comes to cafe hopping.、Mm -hmm. So other attractions here, including the Museum of Contemporary Art,、mm -hmm. which is aesthetically pleasing、oh, for. Oh <laughs> wow! You can read it. Yes, I, I could. Both art and architecture lover. Kiyosumi Garden for the traditional Japanese landscape garden, and Sumida River as well. Yes, the place is close to the famous Asakusa,、okay. so you might want to chill around the river on a pleasant weather. One thing to know in advance, though, be prepared for a lot of walking. Seeing all of the cafes, museums,、mm. garden, and riverside are spread far and wide. You might feel quite a distance from one spot to another. It's probably best to spare one whole day only in Kiyosumi if you want to explore the whole area. Okay, that's what we have. So, are you ready? Yes, I am ready. Let's go. Let's go. Here is our first spot for today, Hatameki Cafe, a small, cozy cafe located just about less than five minutes walk from the Kiyosumi Shirakawa Station. It has an at-home atmosphere with full of interesting stuffs like arts, kimonos, and old tools like a sewing machine here. We should just like buy, take out, and then、mm. go out this area. Okay. こんにちは。テイクアウトお願いできますか。What do you want? アイスコーヒー。はい。じゃあ俺もアイスしよう。一分五分。アイスコーヒー一つで。アイスコーヒー一つ。はい。アイスコーヒーすいません同じで。同じで。はい。はい。はい、すいません。ありがとうございます。Too bad we can't stay, but we will definitely visit here again soon. So we just bought our first coffee of the day. This is ice coffee for both、yes. of us at the store named Hatameki. Hatameki. And they gave us some like free stuff like this. This is for sleeves for the cups. Yeah, it's really and, cute. Yes, and made of leather. Yeah, apparently. Like this. Yeah, it's really cute. 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 Yeah, it's really 
Let's drink it. Okay, let's try. Hmm, mm. You know I cannot drink black coffee, right? Yeah, you don't usually drink black yeah. coffee. So, so when did you first come to Japan? In oh, 2013. Like 2013. Mm. Yeah. So did you feel like any shock or surprise when you came to Japan? So language is one thing. Mm. I learned Japanese in Vietnam. Mm -hmm. For how long? Four, year, four, four years. years. Mm. It's my major in university. Okay. And I thought I can speak a fire bit good. Mm -hmm. But when, when I came here, it was like a whole different level, you know. Oh, really? Because everyone speaks in a very fast bit. Ah, uh, because we are native speakers. Yeah. And one more thing is like, mm. I don't really have any friends back then. Oh, when you came to Japan? Yeah. At that time? Yeah, because it's a whole new country. Yeah, and of course. I, I know someone, Shirai? What, uh, what do you consider? That's Shirai, someone you know. yeah, someone you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I know someone. Mm. They're just someone I know. Mm. And I have no friends here, so uh, it's very lonely. It's hard to make friends. Yeah, I finally understand now after eight years. They used to say that Japanese people make friends in university. Ah, uh, yes. Those friends gonna stay with you like a long time. Mm -hmm. But when you become Sakaijin, mm, like graduated from yeah. schools and like. It's really hard to make friends because everybody is so busy. <sighs> Did you like, make any new friends when you get After into this, I yeah. graduated. Yes, so that's what I feel like also the same because, you know, when I was a student, I, it was easy for me to make friends. But now I'm working and. Yeah. yeah, it's hard. Yeah. So it's rare that we, you know. Yeah, I'm really glad that's where we have uh, <laughs> became friends because, like, you are one of my really rare yeah, Japanese same. friends. Mm, same yeah. for me too. Yeah. Don't make me blush. <laughs> <laughs> when did you come back to Japan? You live in Australia. For yes, a while, Australia. Right? I came back in 2014, so seven years ago. Oh, that's when we first met, right? Yes, oh, that's right. Okay. Did you find something different or something like that? Uh, I felt different, especially, you know, um, I need to take train in the morning and like oh. rush hour, so the trains are really crowded, but it oh. didn't happen in Australia. I just needed to walk like five minutes to office. Uh, so okay. yeah, it's totally different environment. We are at the second destination today a tea specialist shop named Teapot. There are a lot of tea flavor that can be found here. Not only the tea, there are also a lot more display has to offer, like candies that go well with tea, small cute tea boxes, tea sets, and some tea bag collection that good not only for yourself but also souvenirs. Even a coffee lover like me is impressed by this place. So if you are a tea lover like my friend Minami-chan, you have to check it out. Itadakimasu. Mm. They also had to try out some of their suggest teas of the day, and I am totally bored. Too bad we didn't buy anything, but now I have some really good option for Minami-chan's next birthday gift. So how do you feel working in Japan? You've been working for like... Eight, Eight years, years in Japan? Yeah. How do you feel that? Let me see. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think working in Japan is really hard. Hard? Yeah, because Why? like there are a lot of rules you have to follow. Mm. I study Japanese language and culture for a while first, but no matter how hard I try, I still a foreigner. You know? So uh. there's something I can never understand. And it's really hard for me in the beginning mm -hmm. to, to get used to it. To get used to them. Mm. Oh, Sumida River. Sumida River. Yeah. Oh wow! You can oh, see wow. the whole river from here. Sugoi. Oh. Oh, look at that. That's oh, tree. sky tree. Let's take a picture here. Okay. Okay. Oh my God! It looks really good. Sugoi. One more. Yeah. Oh yeah, we can see it. Ah, sugoi. Beautiful, beautiful. Sugoi. Hi, cheese. Okay, Okay. Okay. 
So how about you? In our division, there's a lot of foreigners, you know? Yes. Half of us is foreigners and yes. half of us is German. So how yes. do you feel? Um, honestly, it's really fun, fun. to work with um, people from different places, with different yeah. cultures, because it's always you know, fun to talk and find out new things and communicate and exchange cultures. So, yeah, I really love working in this environment. Do you feel hungry? We should eat something. Mm, I'm hungry. Yeah, let's go and find something to eat. Okay. After a long walk from our last spot, we decided to have lunch at one of the spots that we were really excited about even before actually came today. The Pitman's Cafe. Since it was blazing hot outside, we decided to have our lunch inside, but the cafe's terrace seats are definitely worth trying. Also, you can take some really great pictures with Kiosu Bridge and Tokyo Sky Tree as background like this. Just like a scene in the movie, don't you think? Okay, let's look at the menu. Okay. Yeah. Also, oh, they have breakfast menu, lunch, dinner. What do you want? Uh, Today's lunch. Oh, so Kiyosumi clam chowder lunch. Oh, Kiyosumi clam chowder lunch. What is it? It's like a pan. It's like a pan. It's like a pan. I'm going to have a pan. I ordered the curry dish of the day. And Kaikun ordered a Kiyosumi clam chowder lunch set. They all look and taste so delicious. One more thing that makes me fall in love with this cafe even more is that here you can find a lot of cool products too. Apart from the t shirts and tote bags, there are also some cookies and cute animal stickers. Oh, and I couldn't help but noticing these tea packages too. We spent around 40 minutes or one hour inside the Pitman's cafe. And when we came back outside, the weather got so much cooler than before. So we decided to take a little walk while chatting at the riverside. So are you now already get used to the Yeah, I mean like, I'm working at this country for like 8 years old. Yeah, already, that's so. really long. <laughs> at this point, I think my achievement, mm. can I say it? Mm. <laughs> I don't know, I yeah, can say it. Yeah, you achievement, worked like, hard and uh, came until after, here. Yeah, after 8 years, I became a senpai. Mm, yeah, I think so. Yeah, and so people look at me at the result and what, <laughs> I, what I'm doing. But you have a lot of kohais now yeah. and the office. So. I'm really happy when I first have some Japanese junior. Junior? Yeah. Kohai? Mm. That's a really good feeling. Mm. The breezing wind is so refreshing and I wish we had more time to spend. But it's time for us to call it a day. So? So we've been to like three places today, right? Mm. The tea pond. Yeah. Then the pit Yeah. And the, the first one. Hatam Hatameki. Hatameki. Yeah. Which one do you like the most? I personally... All of them were good, but uh -huh. I like the tea pond. Oh yeah, you like tea. Mm, yeah. Yes, I love tea because uh -huh. you could choose from a lot of different kinds of tea. Uh -huh. And you can buy that really cute container as well. Mm -hmm. And you can even put the message, so it's really good. Yeah. How about you? I really like the first cafe that we go to, oh. the Hatameki, because like they're giving out us like this one. And it's oh, really the cute. Leather sleeves. Yeah. And you know I drink coffee a lot, so yes. it's gonna be really helpful. Mm, you can use it. Yeah. It's the first time in a while I, I did something like take out cafe and then mm. walk around like this. Mm. So I really like that cafe and the riverside walk right here. Mm. It's really good. Yeah, so it's nice to walk around here. So I heard that there are a lot of cafes around in Kiyosumi Shirakawa. And yeah, I yeah. heard that too. Yes, because whenever we go for coffee, <laughs> we always go to Starbucks. But are it's you nice to me try. Right now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's nice to try different types of cafes and there are a lot of different cafes in Kiyosumi Shirakawa. So we should, you know, come back again. Yeah. 
definitely we should come back mm, here because, again yeah there are a lot of later. yes and other we make some more video oh yeah true yes. oh, maybe yeah. we can make another video please subscribe this channel and like this video yeah. and share share. <laughs> share the video to everyone and if you guys uh, have any place in mind that you guys want us to go Please tell it in our comment. Uh, yes, in, in the, the comment comments. Below. Yes, we yeah. would love to know that. For now, see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye.